Can't believe this day is finally here. All the way from sitting in the silver Mercedes in McDonald's all them years ago. When I first see you, I knew. So when someone says love at first sight, I know exactly what they mean because I loved you from when I first met you. You're everything to me and always will be. I love you forever and always. Lee. Lee, I can't believe today is finally here. We are getting married. I feel like the luckiest girl alive. We have come so far this past eight years and we go stronger and stronger every day. There is absolutely no doubt in my mind you are the one for me and we are meant to be together. I know we are going to have a long and happy marriage as we already have all the qualities that make a marriage work. Love, friendship, trust, commitment, patience, forgiveness and the list goes on. You made a promise to me after not knowing me for very long and you have continued to keep that promise and you have never stopped looking after me. Now I promise to do the same for you, to love you for the rest of my life and to be the best wife through good times and bad. This is just the start for us and I'm very excited for this next chapter. You really are the best man a girl could wish for and I cannot wait to call you my husband. I love you so much. That used to be my wife. I will still love you. I will honour and respect you. I will stand by you. I will stand by you and be true to you always. I will care for you. Love with you when you're happy. Love with you when you're happy. And comfort you when you're sad. Whatever life may bring. Whatever life may bring. I will always love you. It gives me the greatest of pleasure to announce that you are husband Why? I'd like to thank you, Kerry, for giving me the special honour and privilege of walking you down the aisle. This is something I will never forget as long as I live. After I first met Lee, I asked Kerry how it was that he's the first boyfriend that she's introduced me to. I said, is he the one? Was it love at first sight? Kerry said, Dad, well, you don't remember. When I was young, you told me, don't bother bringing them round unless they're a Chelsea fan. I knew from that day that Lee was the one for her. I'm not a massive fan of public speaking, but I've written down a few short words for you today. One of the first times I ever see Kel was over the hog roast at Archie's christening party when she was stuffing her face with a full on gluten, yeah, gluten, hog roll with apple sauce. My first thought to her, how the hell was she going to fit that in her mouth? But she did. After that, we smiled at each other and I knew she was the one for me. It wasn't until a whole year later, after trying to get her number through Jay, that she finally gave in and we got together. On August the 29th, we were officially a couple. Hence why we have asked you here today.
Okay, you are the most thoughtful, caring, selfless, funny <laughs> person I know and I am so proud to call you my husband. You make me so happy and I hope I can make you as happy as you make me. <laughs> You're trying to make me cry. I'm not having it. I'm not having it. <laughs> So I'll take this because I'm going to keep it for the whole night. I'll probably end up singing. Get rid of the singers. I'll do it. I'll do it all. Take it. I was going to drop the mic, but it looks well expensive and I ain't got no money left. Cheers, everyone.